Members of the Nigerian Institution of Estate Surveyors and Valuers in Ogun State have taxed the incoming administration to revisit the Land Use Act and prioritize the amendment of the Land Use Decree No. 6. This call was made known by the branch chairman of the institution, Bola Orekoya, at year 2023 Valuation Day celebration held in Abeokuta, the Ogun State capital. He said it was imperative for residents to identify with professional valuers so they don't fall victims of quacks. The chairman also said the government has a role to play towards ensuring valuers carry out their duties unhindered. Speaker after speaker also taxed the incoming administration to put in place enabling land policies that will be beneficial for all. We need uh, sustainable uh, laws that will, of course, uh, regulate the, uh, on, on the part of the government, uh, especially for those of, those of our members who are working with government. So, like the land use decree, uh, uh, number six of 1978, now an act, okay? So, uh, this decree, for instance, is long overdue for amendment. But because it has been entrenched in the Nigerian constitution, the amendment is pretty difficult. But we are still appealing that the way to go is to revisit this land use, land use act and amend where are necessary. Land is a prima facie, it's, it's, a, it's a requirement for all, aspe uh, what do you call it, all um, aspects of life. It's a prima facie qualified for, for all aspects of life. Since all development takes place on land, land should be taken seriously. And the only way land can be taken seriously is by initiating formidable policy to drive land and landed assets. Formidable policy. So I would like the economic administration to look at how to have an enabling and formidable policy, land policy, that will galvanize uh, our economy to posterity. We want the people listening to us to and watching us to know that for everything they are doing on land, the work of an SSO and valuer is very, very important. Starting from you buying your land, you have to consult an SSO and valuer. The kind of property you must put on that on that land when you purchase it, particularly for investment, you must ask SSO and valuer. The fact that your property is along the major road doesn't mean that it fits for residential. It's by the virtue of an advice of an SSO and valuer, you know the kind of investment to put there. When property is completed, how do you manage it? You need an Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.